I'm such a mess and a dress, I'm telling you. Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel if you're new here. Welcome to the family, thank you so much for stopping by. And welcome to December 1st, the first day of my, well, I'm not blogging today, but you'll get what I'm talking about. I did, however, get three packages in the mail. Makes me happy. A lot of them are not for me, but that's okay too. But I did get my Fat Fit Fun box, which is in here. I haven't even opened the box. It comes in this and the box comes inside of it and I did order an add-on because if you don't order an add-on you have to wait till the end of the month to get your box and that's not fair and I'm not patient and I'm just gonna do it you can't see but I have all these boxes surrounding me it's really kind of funny I kind of feel like I'm a little like trapped and you're cockeyed there we go Fab Fit Fun, if you do not know, is my favorite, I would call it lifestyle box because you get makeup, lifestyle items, hair care, fitness, jewelry, everything you can possibly imagine. There are a lot of these boxes out there, as I said, but this one happens to be my favorite. There's a lot of stuffing. Wow, look at the shape this one's in. Jeez. So when you order... Ouch. <laughs> when you order add-on items, you get them at a severely, well, I shouldn't say severely because it's not a bad thing, and an extremely discounted price. And to be honest, you have to pick them way before you get your box. So I don't remember what I ordered, but according to this, I got the sponge gel uh, cleansing sponges, which I had gotten one before. I loved it. I bought two more and used them, and this one was a Bourbon Vanilla Duet. Hello. Comes in a really nice little box here. And oh my, these are different, and they're huge. Normally they're very, 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 <laughs> Ooh, very skinny. Oh, I can smell it through here. I can't wait to use these. Basically, it's just a sponge that you can probably get, like, 25 uses out of it has a cleanser in it and it's just really convenient because the sponge is slightly exfoliating and I like it and I didn't pay that much for it and I have an itchy nose okay the next thing I got was from chlorine chlorine is an expensive hair care brand and yes it's a mask I even love masks for my hair I can't help it and this one is the Nutra reparative mask with desert date not a date, but like a food kind of date. Let's see. Oh, it kind of leaked in the container here. It's all over. Oh my goodness. Do you know what this smells like? Ever have like a bourbon ball or a rum ball at Christmas time? OMG. That's what this smells like. I think I need to wash my hair tonight, whether I actually need to or not. Oh, this is cool. I didn't order this, but it came in the box. It is from V8. It is an orange grapefruit hydrate. One serving of veggies. That sounds really good. I don't like the regular V8. Like, I don't like tomato juice, but that sounds really good. If I didn't have my cup of coffee here, which is just my usual regular puppy mug. Still gotta find my darn Christmas mugs. I would try that right now. The next thing I got was, it is a pack of two, it is the Adriform Hydro Glow Aqua Peel. It says it gently exfoliates and intensely infuses hydration to reveal a youthful glow. And this was opened already. You know, some of this bothers me sometimes, to be honest with you. You're supposed to get four treatments. And, okay, yes, you do. It has two sides. One is the retexturing swab. And the other is the Moisture Infusion Mask. I'm thinking it's kind of like a slight chemical peel and, and then a moisturizing mask. So that seemed really cool. I like that. I don't remember ordering all of this, which is really odd. Then it says here... <laughs> I don't remember ordering this. This is the Dr. Brand DNA Do Not Age Time Defying Anti-Aging Cream. It says it lessens the look of wrinkles and plumps. All right. Ooh, hello, bougie. Because I'm pretty sure this is expensive. Hello, extremely bougie packaging. Um, oh, that's pretty cool. It 
it has a slight scent to it. Let's just a little here. Funny thing is, I know I wouldn't have paid a lot of money for it, so it must, I'm telling you, they have some really deep discounted sales. Mm. Okay, it soaks right in. It comes with a little instructional thing here, which I'll probably read. It seems very technical, but hello, how cute is that? So those were my add-ons. Now let's get to, oh, hold on, there's one more thing in here. Oh, it's just a coupon actually for 50% off a six pack of that V8 juice. Pretty cool. And we have Z-Box. I'm such a mess in a dress, I'm telling you. Anyway, this is a really, really cute box. They've got a fireplace, they have some lights strung up, they have three chicks hanging out with some coffee. Yeah, that's fun. By the way, I will have a link down below in the description, which I believe gives you $20 off of a box. Yes, if you do use my link, I do get whatever the discount is, I get that off of my next box, just throwing it out there. You don't have to use my link, of course, but I just want to be transparent and tell you. So when you get the box, it says find your cozy. <laughs> when you get the box, we always get these magazines, which I actually really like. I do read them and they're kind of fun. But they tell you also about uh, what products you get. So in here is a $15 coupon. I will put this in the description box in case you don't want to use my link. It gets you off, gets you off? It gets you $15 off your box. I'll put that in the description. Oh, here's like a little disclaimer. Interesting. It says, hi there. We hope you're enjoying all of the amazing things that came in your winter box this season. It's curated with lots of love, and we can't wait for you to unpack it all. You may notice that there is one customization item in the magazine that was not available to all members. Uh, the Chic and Tonic I'll Coast to that four-piece coaster set. Unfortunately, there was an issue with the factory, and some of the coasters did not meet our standards. So to ensure every box is the same great quality, we made the decision to exclude a portion of the coasters from the box. Instead, members are being treated to a surprise item that has a higher retail value of $25 plus, and they apologize. Well, I'm glad at least they put that disclaimer in there. Ooh, she's filled. Look. She's stuffed. And something just jumped out, so I may as well use it. <laughs> They must, they must know me. They must know me. This is black. I have tried these before, and I did enjoy them in the past, as far as I remember. This is a full box of five of the masks. They are not inexpensive eye masks. These have hyaluronic acid in them. Again, I will try them again and put it in my masking series and let you know what you think, but you do get a full box of five, which... As I said, these are not cheap, so it might even be close to the cost of the box already. The next thing in here is from Elevate. It is two essential oils. That's so funny because I'm actually going to be doing a video on some essential oils that I was sent for review. I love essential oils. If you have not tried them, I don't use them on my face, but they have different scents that are beneficial for different things, calming, energizing, sleeping, all of those things. In this, we are getting eucalyptus, which is definitely a stress reliever. I have some stress. Let me smell them. Here's the eucalyptus. It is quite stress relieving. Well, I have a kitten that wants to get by, and I have boxes everywhere. Go ahead, Baxter. So eucalyptus is for calming, and then they have orange, and orange is energizing. You could use some of that too. Oh my goodness, it literally smells like, you know when you just peel an orange? That's exactly what it smells like. Oh, when I use these, I put them on my pulse points. Sometimes I will massage them on my temples if I'm relaxing. Yeah, I like... That's really awesome. Now I have more essential oils than I will probably ever, ever need. This is interesting. This is from Moroccan Gold Series. It is a hair treatment mask for dry and damaged hair. I'm going to be set for hair masks for quite some time. The packaging is very, very pretty. Quite full, right to the top. It has... A bit of a florally, 
but also a nut smell. I can't quite, quite place it, but it's really very pleasant. So I will give these a shot. I don't know which hair mask I'm going to use first now, but at least I have a lot of them to try. Now we have another mask. This must be a thing of masks and I don't know, but this is a Hava. I have used a Hava before. It is a pricey as well. This is a hydration cream mask. This one happens to be for your skin. Yes, I'm sure. I did read the back of the bottle. Uh, it's hydrate. I love anything hydrating for my skin, especially in the winter time. And I'll be anxious to try this one. This is fabulous. I don't know if it's full size. I guess it would have to be. But this is Kate Somerville, and this is the Exfolicate, a very popular product in her line. So this is basically an acid peel, kind of like the TLC Baby Facial from Drunk Elephant. You leave it on for about two minutes. It does have lactic acid. Lactic acid is an exfoliant, chemical exfoliant for your skin. I will be anxious to compare this to the TLC Baby Facial because that happens to be one that I love. So I will give you that comparison after I try this for a few times. That is pretty cool. Also, probably about $100 from what I remember about Kate Somerville. This is from Thrive Cosmetics. I have heard about them. From what I understand, I think they are a company, maybe a fair trade company. I'm not really sure. I'll have to research, but this is the Brilliant Eye Brightener Highlighting Stick. It says her ring light technology. That's kind of funny. Shine bright with long lasting champagne shimmering powdered, powered by ring light technology to diffuse light and define features. Instantly highlights, brightens, and opens your eyes to a use. Apply to brow bone, lids, a waterline, waterline, and corners of eyes. How could you apply this in your waterline? Okay, it's a stick. Oh, okay. It's very creamy. It is a twist up, which I like a lot. It's definitely subtle, but it's quite pretty. I am super interested to try this, especially in my waterline. Cool. Can you believe this keeps going? We got a palette, an OMG. I wanted this palette, but I had self-restraint and I didn't order this palette even though it was ridiculously on sale over Black Friday. It is the Pure Cosmetics. Where's my up opener? It was right in front of me. This is the Be Your Selfie palette. I happen to like Pure shadows and I'm so excited that I have another palette to play with. Beautiful design. This is raised glitter over here does not come off on your hands. This is a matte white package. Ooh, pretty. They have the names on the shadows, which I love. They do seal this on the end, and I always keep it on there because then you just flip it over and close it so you don't lose it. So I always only take off one side. That, my friends, is a beautiful palette. And it smells, it smells good. I think I might have some of these shadows already in other palettes, but that I'm not bother bothered by at all. These are creamy and pigmented, soft. Yeah, I'm happy. I got the palette. I think it was probably $35. I'm not exactly sure how much. I am so happy that I got that. Yay, thanks for having fun. Next up, we have something with a lot of fuzzies on it. This is from Mark and Graham Personalized Gifts. I think this is a blankie or a throw. And it has a nice, like, um, herringbone weaved texture. Ooh. I think it's a blankie or a throw. And it's very soft, although it could be, <laughs> I don't know, could it be a scarf? I'm, I'm just not sure. Whatever it is, the color is pretty and neutral, and I like it, and I'm going to read up on what it is. There is one thing left in here, and I don't know what it is. 
oh, it's a necklace because it just says circle necklace. Uh, from Lily or Lele, I don't know. So I can't pronounce it. Sadohi, S A D O U G H I. I hate mispronouncing things. It says this circle necklace is the perfect introduction to peace for every woman. Explore all of her, whomever she is, geometric, feminine, and colorful designs. And they give you her a website. Interesting packaging. Oh, how pretty. Wait, it gives you... Hold on. I don't know what that is, but that's okay. This is stunning. I really, really like that. It's simple. It's pretty. It's obviously costume jewelry. I think that's awesome. Really, really cool. I'm so happy to have that. Let's read up, shall we? I mean, I'm thrilled with the box. Let me just get my, have a cup of coffee and read the magazine. Those usually go together. Brooke Burke, I thought I recognized her, is featured on the cover. And by the way, they just, they say they're celebrating one million members. Honestly, that's pretty cool. How awesome would it be for me to get one million followers? Yeah. Okay, what's in the box? The value can be anywhere from 290 to 335. So the first thing is this Mark and Graham color block throw. It is a throw. You could have either gotten it in gray and ivory or natural and ivory. And I'm assuming that this is the natural and ivory. And I would have been happy with either one of them. It says um, you do have to hand wash it and you cannot put it in the dryer. You have to lay it flat. That's $49. That's a lot of money. I usually buy my throws in TJ Maxx for, you know, $10 to $12. The next thing you could have gotten, either one, you could have gotten a bare paw combo set, which is a head wrap and fingerless gloves, valued at $45. Or you could have gotten the Moroccan Gold Series Treatment Mask, which is this. <laughs> which is this, and it says it seals split ends, strengthens hair, and makes your tresses more manageable with this fortifying blend of argan oil and keratin compounds it is also a $49 and the good thing is they says you only have to leave it on your hair for about five to seven minutes which is the perfect amount of time in the shower for me super cool then you could have gotten one of three items a Halston jewelry portfolio which is pretty cool but I don't travel anywhere so I wouldn't have needed that and that is H Halston by the way that would have been $48 you could have gotten Orbe a gold lust dry shampoo which you know I don't use it, so that's $45, and I'm so glad I didn't get that. Or you could have gotten the necklace here. And the necklace is valued at $49. Again, I wouldn't have paid $49 for it, but I'm glad that I have it. It's silver-plated um, over brass, so it means you really can't wear it in the shower. You don't want to get any perfume or lotions on it because it will ruin it, but uh, it tells you to store it in a velvet or something, a pouch. The other thing that you could have gotten a choice of three of, well, not a choice necessarily because I don't like to choose. I like to be surprised. You could have gotten over-the-knee textured socks, which would have been $24, or you could have gotten a Sherry Matthews acupuncture jade stone roller. I have one of these. I don't know if they do a darn thing, but they feel really good when you put them on, roll them on your face. And uh, that is $45. I got mine in TJ Maxx for like 15. Just throwing that out there. For the Be Your Selfie palette, and I was corrected, is $35. I'm so happy that I got that palette. I cannot wait to play with it. I'll probably do a look if you want. You could have gotten um, the Bite Beauty Amuse Bouche Lipstick, the coasters that they were talking about, the Brooke Burke Body Sliders. Whoops. Hold that the way. Which, these look really cool, and I think I would have liked those. They're fitness sliders. That's pretty cool. Maybe they'll have them, like, when I can buy them afterwards. You could have gotten the um, Sweet Orange Oil and Eucalyptus um, set for $31, or you could have gotten Anthropology um, Body Cream in Coconut Sugar. If I had a choice, I would have probably liked the body cream or the sliders, 
but I'm happy with the essential oils. One day I'll be able to afford to upgrade because it's like 200 and something dollars at one time for the year. One day hopefully I'll be able to do that. And then here you could have gotten, actually you did get this, all of these items in the box because it says it was in every box, the Thrive Cosmetics Brighten Eye Brightener in Stella. It says it's infused with macadamia and meadow foam oil. It's a champagne eye brightener, instantly brightens and highlights your eyes. $24 is the cost of this. The hydration mask from Ahava is $33. Ouch. You can use it as a three-minute mask to wash off, and you can also use this as a sleeping mask. I'll try it both ways for you guys. And then, of course, my favorite, the Black Hydrogel Eye Mask with the Hyaluronic Acid, and these are $29. And then you only have to leave them on for 10 for 15 minutes, which is my preferred type of under-eye mask for the mornings. And then you can get these guys at 30 to 70% off at the Winter Edit Sale, which is coming up the day after Christmas. Yeah, I'll probably, I'll probably be getting some of that. <laughs> Again, they give you recipes and ideas on how to use the products and everything like that. I absolutely love, 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 love reading this. And it's, if you can afford to get this type of box, then I highly suggest it. So that is it, my friends. I really, really love this box. I'm so thrilled with everything that I got. I said it's a $49 box. Some items I might have purchased myself, like the Pure Palette, if I could have. But everything, there are things that I probably wouldn't have picked out. But I'm so glad I have and I'm going to use and enjoy and love. If you get this box, let me know. Some of them are the same, some of them are customized, some you get surprised. So I would love to hear your thoughts on everything if you actually own any of this stuff. And that's it. As usual, thank you so much for watching, my friends, wherever you are, whatever corner of the planet you are in, on. <laughs> I hope wherever you are, you're having an amazing day. Hope you have an amazing week. I have a few more videos to film. Sorry you're going to be seeing this look a few times, but I hope you love me anyway. If you do, or you are new here, if you wouldn't mind liking and subscribing, that would be Bean. I can't talk, people. Maybe you won't want to subscribe. It would mean everything to me, though. And I'll see you in my very next one. Bye, everybody.